Hello guys, welcome to Ramp Hobbies and today it's unboxing time! So we're going to unbox this Takara Tomy D191 Overdrive Special Starter Set. Make sure to watch until the end because we have a B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set International Giveaway. And we will put the steps in order to join the giveaway throughout the video. But before we start our unboxing video, we would just like to say thank you to Hobby Digi. They are an international toy store that sells very affordable Takara Tomy Beyblade products. And I will just put their link in the description below. Make sure to check them out. They are the one who gave us this B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set and the one for the Beyblade Giveaway. Okay guys, let's quickly look at the box first. So this is the Prominence Phoenix, Dangerous Belial, Savior Perseus, and the owner of the Prominence Phoenix is Phenomeno Pain. Correct me if I'm wrong. And of course, the owner of the Dangerous Belial, the Overdrive Beyblade is Bell Daikokoten. We are going to also get the new DB Bay Langer. This one have a uh, gear included on the part. And this is the first time that Takara Tomy uh, created this one. Back of the box, here you can see the Dangerous Belial parts. The DB Core is Belial. The blade is Dangerous. The armor is 2. And the disc plus driver is all mine. And here you can see the L, S, F and V gear can be attached to the Dangerous Belial. So this will be the perfect Dangerous Belial Beyblade combo. This one is explaining that the DB Core Belial 2 has a burst stopper gimmick. And this one is showing the gimmick of the All Might Driver where if you launch it with your full power, it will turn to the attack mode. Okay, so here is the Prominence Phoenix part. The DB Core is Phoenix. The blade is Prominence. The armor is 10. The disc is tapered and the new driver is the Metal Universe. For the Savior Perseus, the DB Core is Perseus. The blade is Savior. Armor is 3. Disc is Giga and the Bearing Dash driver is now available. And of course, we have the Sun Pac-Man! Okay guys, so here is the stickers of the B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set. So this one is the stickers of the Dangerous Belial All Might 2, the stickers of the Prominence Phoenix, and the stickers of the Savior Perseus. And here's the Dynamite Battle Customized Guide. Let's just look at them very closely and very fast. There you go. Oh, F gear for the Dangerous Belial Blade. S gear for the Prominence Phoenix combo. V gear for the All Might. Okay. And of course, we all know the B190 all in one set. And the next Beyblade product, the B192. This is the Overdrive Beyblade of Rashad Good Dumanda. And here's the guide in Japanese. Okay, okay. This one is uh, very big this time because we have a lot of gimmicks, so they needed to explain everything. So there you go. You can put this the metal. You can put it this way and this way. This one is uh, activating or being an attack type when you launch it with your full power. There you go. And the other informations here: the prominence blade, the prominence armor. The V gear, the other gears. Oh man, there is a lot of explanation that is going on here. But for now, let's continue with our unboxing video. Okay guys, so here's the Dangerous Belial. Let's quickly look at it closely before we check the weight and review the parts. Oh man, this is really awesome you guys. Without the stickers, it's already looking very good and as you can see the prominence phoenix is be very big it's very thick <laughs> it's actually larger than dangerous belial but we'll see the comparison later if we put all the gears of the dangerous belial so there you go here is the prominence phoenix prominence oh phoenix man is my favorite this is favorite. really looking good and of course the savior Perseus Perseus I'm not per actually sure how to pronounce it correctly it's and of course this is the bearing dash oh man bearing Seriously. dash is a great day. bearing is actually very competitive right now but make it dash then we have a new best driver and, and of course this, this is the new DB Bay launcher with the gear here we'll also review this in detail Later, it's 
very long I cannot actually pull it very in full without uh, without hitting the camera <laughs> so here is the new DB Bay launcher so, okay guys time to check the weight of the part so this is the Belial 2 DB core 8.1 Phoenix 7.6 the Perseus this one should be very heavy 10.5 okay as you guys can see this is actually very heavy because this part are made of metals so there you go the weight is 10.6 oh man it's heavier than than the Belial to 8.1 so time to check the dangerous blade 9.7 prominence 14.6 oh my god and the savior is 11.4 for the armor, we already know all of this armor. 13.5, 13.2, 13 and this is the All Might Disc Plus Driver. So this is around, hold on, 38. That's actually very heavy. Tapered is 28.7. This one is Giga, right? Giga. Giga. 32.3. And let's metal universe. By the way, let's compare the Metal Universe with the Universe and the Bearing Dash with the Bearing. What else do we need to compare? Let's also compare the Savior. Okay. So, Savior was 11.4. Savior Awakened. Wait. 10.7? Why is this very heavy? 11.2 okay so i guess our savior is just a little bit light so for the universe universe is 8.8 .8. metal universe is 11 <laughs> and bearing normal bearing is 6.2 bearing dash is 6.4 so just a little bit heavier and now let's uh, build all the combos and compare the weights okay let's now check the weight of the full combo so dangerous Belial is oh it's only 69.3 interesting it's 69.3 prominence phoenix is 75.1 75.1 savior perseus is 73.8 oh this is 75 perfect Belial is 82 let's also check the weight of the dangerous the perfect dangerous Belial later. Savior Valkyrie is 74. Savior Valkyrie is 74.8. The red Savior Valkyrie. Cyclone Ragnarok is 68.8. Vanish of Near is 71.6. Roar Bahamut 73.3. The roll Bahamut from the B190 Beyblade DB all in one set is 74.6. It is because of the metal drift. Astral Spree Gun is around 78. 78? Totally heavier than this, right? This is just 75. And of course, the Guilty Longinus is 78.7. This is the perfect Dangerous Belial. And this is the perfect dynamite Belial. So perfect Belial and perfect dangerous Belial. As you guys can see, <laughs> this is taller. And I guess more chunkier. Let's check the weight. And by the way, there is still one mode for this. You can lower the... You can actually lower the S gear. There you go. So that, that is the difference. This this mode looks more like the perfect Belial. Hmm. How will it perform in the battle? Anyway, let's just check the weight first. Weight comparison. So perfect Belial is 82.1. 82.1. Perfect Belial. Perfect dangerous Belial. Oh wow! 81! 81? 82? Really? 
Ah no, the figure is not yet here. <laughs> well done, guys. I'm sorry. I think you should put it like that. Okay. <laughs> sorry, guys. I forgot to put the figure. That's why I guess that's why it's lighter. So it's actually 60. 86.7 86.7 Oh my god, I forgot to put the V gear. So, that's the difference. Okay guys, we will now review the Dangerous Belial parts. This is the DB Core Belial 2. As you can see here, this is the face of Dangerous Belial Avatar. And it also have the same color team as before but I like the color for this one better and this is the anti-burst or the burst stopper gimmick if you launch it with your full power this one will move here hold on there you go as you can see this will stop the Beyblade from bursting there you go burst stopper so you just need yes correct just like in the Chosy series but where different. they have the burst but stopper different. if you pull it we, when you launch it with your full power. Yes. So but Belial yes. 2 DB Core. Dangerous Blade. So this actually looks like Savior Blade, right? Hold on. Yeah. Look. Just like my dad said it. It's almost the know. same idea. There it have three blades or contact point. And though this one is oh, it's actually made of rubber. Just like hold on, hold on. I think this one oh have the the same material as the F gear. This is definitely hard rubber, and this is plastic. So I also like the color of this one. There you go, rubber. You can hold on. This one is hard rubber, definitely not soft. Because the one from the <laughs> Banish Pop near you can actually squish it. So there you go. I guess no no other gimmicks for this one other than this is made of rubber. This one is the armor. We already know this one. All Might Driver. So it have this metal part on it. Then you just need to put it like this. Yeah. And there's another mode. You can put it like this instead. Also so high and low mode, yes right? let's try the difference for this one but I guess this one is better because I guess it will have lower center of gravity in my opinion and this one hold on this part this one is supposed to pull if you launch it with your pull power hold on can we make that because this one is pre spinning right now and there's a tip here but if you launch it with your pull power that tip will be pull inside I guess let's just do a slow mo for this one also if so we can see it so that's all for the dangerous Belial Beyblade parts okay guys so here are the prominent Phoenix Beyblade parts let's discuss the driver first so this is the metal universe so this part is pre-spinning and these two it's actually really cool so there you go this one is really tight by the way next part is the tapered disc so originally this is from the vanish pop near Beyblade and this is actually seeing competitive play so nice addition for the B191 Beyblade product the Phoenix DB Core so the color of this one is really awesome and you can actually see the Phoenix avatar here and I guess there is no there is nothing unique from this I mean unlike the DB core of the Savior Belial 2 where it has burst stopper the Bahamut it also have burst stopper and the Longinus DB core is very heavy because of the metals like the Perseus. But let's see, let's see if this will see some competitive play. And of course, we have the Prominence Armor or the Prominence Blade. So there you go. This is 
the DB version of the Perfect Phoenix or the Revive Phoenix uh, Beyblade where the armor is getting the attach of the Beyblade and then it will ideally attack the opponent. Oh man, this is very thick. Let's, uh, there is two modes for this one by the way. Let's uh, put the combos first. So the first mode is this one. So you will... You will put this silver part on the top and bottom. There is a part here that is slant. There you go, there, that part. There. So if you move it like this, then it will deattach itself, the armor. So there you go. So the idea if it... Hold on. There you go. If it will move like that, then, oh, oof, it will be removed. So that's the first mode. The second mode is if you put it like this. So there you go. So it's really hard to remove. Hold on, let me see. Oh, we can actually still remove it. But I guess it is harder. Let's just see in the bottle, but you can put it this way. Hold on. <coughs> And also like this and the other mode is it is easier to remove the armor than the other one so this is the prominence Phoenix Beyblade combo okay so for the Savior Perseus Perseus DB core this is actually very heavy as you guys can see in the weight comparison because this is made of metal unlike the other DB core where this part is not metal Oh man, this is in insane. So I guess this will actually see competitive play. And of course, this is the recolored version of the Savior Blade. Nothing new here. This is the Armor 2. Giga also. And this is one of the most hype or high demand Beyblade part right now. The Dash Bearing. Because... As you know, recently in the past 3 months, the bearing driver is seeing a lot of play. Imagine making it dash, right? So this is the B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set. It's definitely 200% must buy for all bladers, collectors, competitive bladers. This is a must buy. So there you go. And again, if you want to buy your own B191 Special Overdrive special starter set buy them from hobby digi i will put the link in the description below there you go it's really <laughs> nice Woo! okay guys so this is the new db bay launcher from the b191 overdrive special starter set so let's discuss what is different from this bay launcher to the regular one so first things first is that the string of this one is much longer than the regular one that's the first thing Second thing is that, hold on, this gear, this gear is actually smaller than the regular one. So, smaller gear means more rotation. So, there you go. This one is the same size as the regular one. This is smaller. And as you can see, there is a power written here. That's the second thing. And the third thing that is different is that this actually have... A bearing here that's why it is longer and heavier so let's compare it feels very smooth but this one I think is will spin more I'm to be honest I'm not actually sure what is the purpose of this one maybe it is so it will rotate smoother I'm not sure let me know in the comment section if you know the purpose but I guess this should be better right hold on let me try the feel hmm, it's actually honestly the sound it's making is not that good in my own opinion hold on let me feel this one too hmm. okay how about this Oh, not returning that fast. 
Anyway, this the strings of this one should be the same because this is from the B19. Oh no! It's longer! Oh man, is it longer than the power? Because this one is from the B187 Saber Valkyrie and this one is longer than the regular one. And it seems that the from the string of the bay launcher from the B191 is actually longer. So this should be the longest string uh, as of the present. It's longer than the regular one. It's longer than the B187. Oh man. So this is definitely the most powerful DB bay launcher currently. So definitely B191 must buy. Okay guys, so let's do a test battle for the Savior Versus with a Bearing Dash Driver. Are you ready? 3, Three 2, 1! <laughs> okay guys, that Maybe was a the same speed double that. burst. Not sure who won that one, but it was a double burst. Oh yeah, again, ready? 3, 2, Three, one. 1 Maybe I lost it a bit weak Maybe oh. 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 not oh. First finish Winners the Savior Purchase Okay, let's do some test battles for the Prominent Phoenix in this mode Are you ready? 3, Three 2, two one. 1 Oh! Oh! Okay, Like, yes! It's like the move in the anime. Our winner is Prominent Phoenix Beyblade. Are you ready? 3, Three 2, two one. 1. Okay, so there's the activator. Nice hit from Savior Valkyrie. Our winner is Prominence Phoenix. So let's try. Hold on. So there you go. Let's try this mode now. There you go. This mode now. Test battles. Are you ready? 3, Eight, 2, one. 1. By the way, Roar Bamut is really good. Let's see if the Prominence Phoenix can win against it. Stamina battle. Oh, I think it's a draw. Are you ready? 3, Three 2, two one. 1! Nice hits. We are both battling in the center of the stadium. By the way, the Road Bahamut, especially its driver, is really good in the stadium. But let's see who's going to win. Oh wow! The prominent Phoenix won against Road Bahamut. Okay, next battle. Okay, let's do some test battles for the Dangerous Belial Beyblade. Okay, ready? 3, Three 2, one. 1! So our opponent is Cyclone Rakaru. This is just like in the anime. Oh, first! Winner is Dangerous Belial. Yeah. Okay, ready? 3, Three 2, one. 1! Shoot! <laughs> Alright, so winner is Dangerous Bell. Nice battle Bella. cry work. Yes, burst finish. Nice battle cry, <laughs> right? Oh man, look at the never driver. <laughs> it's still swinging, okay. There you go. Winner is Dangerous Bellial. Okay guys, so that is all for our B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set Unboxing review and test battles video by the way guys we will do 
uh, full battle for the Dangerous Belial, Prominence Phoenix, Savior Perseus versus all of our DB Beyblades and also versus uh, other Beyblades too like for example all the Longinus, all the Fafnirs and uh, do all some testing and battles using the new Beyblade parts from the B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set so make sure you are subscribed to our channel so you can see that and for the B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set International Beyblade Giveaway so the first step is to like this video like number two is to comment below on why you want to win the B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set Beyblade product step three is to subscribe to our channel and make sure to hit the notification bell icon button so you will be notified for our latest videos Step number 4 is to share this video in one of the following Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter And also make sure to put Ramp Hobbies Beyblade Giveaway in your caption Step number 5 is to count how many times did Bell Dai Kokoten appear in this video So you need to count the number of times Bell appeared in the video from start to the end of the video Step number 6 is to email us the screenshot of step number 1, 2, 3, and 4 and your answer in step number 5 so a screenshot of your like a screenshot of your comment a screenshot that you are subscribed to our channel and a screenshot of your share in one of the following Facebook, Instagram or Twitter and of course your answer in number step number 5 which is how many times did Bell Daikokoten appeared, appeared in the video our email address is rampabis at gmail.com I will also put our email address in the description below Okay guys, so that's all for our B191 Overdrive Special Starter Set Unboxing, Review, and Test Battle Video, and also the giveaway details. Like the video, subscribe to our channel if you haven't subscribed yet. Again, thank you to Habidigi for sponsoring this Beyblade product and the giveaway. Make sure to check them out. Thank you guys for watching. You are awesome. Bye-bye.